of President Biden meeting with the President Zelensky of Ukraine there at that summit. Let's listen in live, raw, and unfiltered. And, and Americans, all of America, Americans and, and Congress, uh, I mean, uh, thank you, Mr. Bradman, that you, like we say, shoulder to shoulder with us from first days of full-scale war. We appreciate for this very much. And uh, uh, really, really, you know, we, we understand your uh, leading support because when you give such messages and when you gave Sometimes some, some weapon, I, I'm, I'm sorry, that, um, but I want to say it to journalists, like I, I said during our meeting, our council, that it's very simple, you know, to criticize, for example, cluster of ammunition, uh, which you made decision, difficult political decision, but, it's, but you, you have to know that Russia used such weapon from the first days, not only full-scale war from first days of occupation of Crimea in, in, from 2014 and 15 in all our t territories in Donbass they used it and now they continue doing it. and that you gave us this decision will help us to save us and that's why my appreciation for, for this and I didn't hear from all the you know parts of the world when when Russia began to use it I didn't hear that some of you know countries criticized Russia you, you know but I think that it was very useful to put them so thank you so much for this help we really counted on it not only on this I mean that's totally and you gave us huge support I want to thank to all Americans who understand that it's more than 43 billions for today. <coughs> it's big support, and I understand that it's all your money, but but you, you have to know that you spend this money for, for not, not just for fighting. You spend this money for our lives, and uh, I think that we save the, the lives for, for, for Europe and for, for all the world. <coughs> so, Thank you very much for this also summit. Uh, at, at, the, at the end of the summit we, we had, I think, this council and great success and security guarantees, as you said, that we began to speak it, about it in Kyiv. So now we see that we had, you had great idea, that G7, and now I know that last message that also there are countries which join to G7 decisions, and I think it will help very much because it, it's really fact that it's very concrete things. So, thank you. Well, thank you, and thank you for acknowledging <laughs> the American people. Uh, I think it's correct that uh, we are a large country, but I think we've given more than every other nation combined in terms of assistance and cost. And the American people uh, are supportive. They're supportive because they know it's, it's about you, but it's about more than you. It's about innocent people around the world and the, the uh, absolute brutality with which Putin is acting and the Russians are moving on. It's just, it's just some, like something out of the 14th century, the way they're acting. And so, but, but I can't emphasize enough. And by the way, I know you thanked him, but I think we talked about it before I went to Tokyo a, year, more, a couple of years ago. The idea that Kishida is increasing their defense budget, having to lower their domestic budget to aid directly and get directly involved in what's happening in Ukraine is remarkable. The sad, sad news is you're in this situation. The incredible news is it's bringing the world together. It's bringing the world together in a way that it's a hell of a price to pay. But it's bringing the world together. And people are realizing that uh, um, you just can't stand by and let this kind of aggression occur. At any rate, I thank you, and we got a lot to talk about, so.
Somebody's going to have to say the press has to leave. <laughs> President Zelensky, are you satisfied with what you got from NATO? You were so frustrated yesterday. Is this enough? Are you satisfied, sir? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I think from talking today and the summit, we, we had great unity from our leaders and security guarantees that the success for this summit. I think so, but it's my opinion. Thank you. Thank you, sir.